one obvious question I think some people are going to have now, and we touched upon Xabi Alonso before, it's it's almost like too obvious. Yeah. The man is under contract with Bayer Leverkusen. He's phenomenal, uh, unbeaten uh, this season, except for... Uh, um, no, he is unbeaten. No, unbeaten Sorry, yeah. unbeaten yeah, this season. In the league and in Europe. Uh, in the league and in Europe, um, which is phenomenal. It's nearly <laughs> February. Uh, and obviously people have said, well, if he leaves, he's going to go to one of his former clubs. His former clubs are um, Real Madrid, Liverpool, Bayern Munich. And we all saw that. Don't forget, forget. Don't forget. Everybody yeah. seems to forget yeah. that, right? I mean, we talked about the conspiracy, people putting two plus two, but I don't see Xabi Alonso committing to leaving now when he can deliver a historic title because word yeah. gets out. Word will get out. Yeah. Um, alternatives to Xabi Alonso? Do you, I mean, do, you, do, you, like, like, do, do, we, do we agree that it's highly unlikely that FSG have seriously approached people? Yeah, surely. We would know by now. So I don't think they have. And also, So could it be that they're looking for the sporting director? I think he could. I think it would make sense. I think a Nagelsmann, if he's on the, the market, could be tempting, interesting. The thing is, you're never going to get someone like Klopp. Never no. get that. You're not getting a level. replacement. You're getting a successor. Yeah, yeah, exactly. So if you want something, as so, or someone sorry, as close as Klopp, I don't even know where you go and where you look at. Because even Xabi Alonso plays a different style, a different formation. He's got a different personality. So, I, I don't know. I think it's a really tricky one. And also, if you after somebody already at a club like Xabi Alonso, and the guy said, listen, I'm not saying yes, I'm not saying no, I'm saying let's meet at the end of the season, then what do you do? You wait? Can you can, can Liverpool really wait that long? No, you, you get a director of football. You, you yeah, work but, on the director of football. Yeah, true, okay. But you, let's say you get Paul Mitchell for the sake of it. Mm -hmm. So Paul Mitchell, if he wants to hire Xabi Alonso and Xabi says, listen, maybe, maybe not, I don't know yet, but let's, let's, I don't want to talk about it and hear about it until the, the season is finished. Can you really afford to wait all that long to prepare for I think you a can. succession of club? I think you can, I think you have to, and I think you owe it to, you owe it to Klopp anyway, right? Not to, <coughs> not to allow this to be a distraction to, to the team between now and the end of the season. Yeah. And I'll leave you with this quote from yeah. Eckhart Tolle, the guy who wrote The Power of Now. Yeah. Just to remind your Liverpool fans, it's a scary time. I get that. You can't control the past. It's gone. You can't control the future because you, it's not here yet. But you can control and enjoy the present. You've got three more months of Klopp. Enjoy it.